out lock in, meet some friends, man. We remember being in third grade. This is how we talked. This is how we acted. And, you know, I think most people, if they really think hard, you know, you, everyone, everyone talks about, oh, the, the beauty and naivety of children. And, but if you think back to what you were in third grade, you were just, everyone was kind of a rotten jerk. You know? <laughs> That's what's so fun, uh, fun about it for us is, is that it's, it's so real. Well, that whole experience sure did suck. The title of the premiere episode is Carmen Gets, gets an Anal Probe. probe. That didn't happen to us in third grade. That's an embellishment. No. <laughs> it's a somewhat of an embellishment. <laughs> was it the ones with the big long heads and the black eyes? Yeah, I think that they and us together, Comedy Central and us together, made a conscious effort to be like, okay, let's not just focus on just foul language for the sake of foul language. And that was really the thing we, we focused on was, yes, let the kids talk the way they talk. And if they just have to say something like that, then they should. <laughs> but but it shouldn't be the point of the show. But I think staying away from like just the gratuitous kind of like let's let's use curse words just for the sake of it. I think it's made the show a lot better because you don't have to rely on that. You can rely on more sophisticated humor and like fart jokes. jokes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is the most genius plan ever. We had heard. Oh, George Clooney's a big fan, and we're like, that's cool, because we had heard a lot of people that were big fans, but George was like cool enough to like really embrace us, you know. And, and it wasn't just it wasn't just lip service. He was like, let me do a voice. Yeah. Actually, we were with George at the he he invited us to the Batman premiere party, and so we're just standing around George, and of course, you know, people are just swarming George. Yeah, that's George's premiere like, party. Yeah, George is like, hey, I want you guys to meet these guys.